beautiful, lovely morning here in Natal. Uh, with some big storms running through, I know, on the north coast and Lucia area. The long-awaited big storm, so we're hoping that that affects that uh, whole water system and estuary quite positive. And uh, quite excited to get some news from there to see if that possibly opens that estuary. But guys, on the catches, there's been so many catches this week and I want to thank you all for sending in your catches. There's a whole horde of catches. And this is our part four of the news flash this week, bringing you catches from all over South Africa. And remember, you can send your catches to Grinder Elite at asfn.co.za. And you can also use your cell phone to take videos. Just remember to turn your cell phone horizontal or landscape, as some of you know it, when taking the videos of you catching some fish. First, we're joining Riyad Hursen with a great catch of a sand shark or guitar fish of 167 centimeters pre-caudal length. Now guys, just a tip on the sand sharks and smooth down sharks, anything without teeth, not edible fish without teeth, we look at full length uh, to actually do the weight conversion. And then your sharks, the ones with the serious teeth, that is pre-caudal, from the pre-caudal to the tip of the nose, just as, as a pointer. Riyad was using his Grinder Elite 14 foot 6, matched up with his Saltus 8000, loaded with 40 pound J-Brake. And then Mohammed Zaifa, you guys are all getting used to him, got a really nice shad of 4.5 kilos, as well as a 23 kilo brown skate. Mohammed was using his Grinder Elite rod with his Daiwa Catalina reel loaded with 40 pound J-Brake. Then we're joining Lloyd Pereira with also a very nice brown skate, Caught on his Grind Elite 15 foot, matched up with a Saltus 8000. Then we're joining Caleb Alston Stewart, who got a really nice size Pompano and a shad of 3.5 kilos fishing at Mshlanga Lighthouse. Caleb was using his Daiwa XL Elite 10 foot 6 with a Procaster 4000 loaded with 20 pound J braid. Ruben Lombard got stuck into the bonitas of the side and really filled up his bait freezer using J braid. Guys, here's some really nice feedback from Mohammed Tariq Adams from Western Cape Fishing Under 16's League. Mohammed ended up the champion angler in the Western Cape School League's tournament as overall winner and also biggest non-edible. Let's have a look at some of the catches. Mohammed was using his Daiwa BG6500 with 48 pound gator braid. Well done Mohammed, what an achievement. Myron Woodley was rewarded with a sand shark at St. Lucia Main Beach using a cast master and his Daiwa Saltus 50. Myron was using a mackerel head and cutlet cast bait. Now well done to all the catches guys, thank you for sending in your catches and remember to send any of your catches to Grinder Elite at asfn.co.za That is Grinder Elite at asfn.co.za